and welcome back to my channel. Today I'm doing a review for Ipsy and Birchbox, which are monthly subscription companies that I have shipped to my house. And they just give me different beauty products and stuff, so I'm just going to kind of have a little battle between the two of them and tell you guys how they're different and how you can tell which one you want to subscribe to. I mean, both of them are great. No, this is not a promotion, but I just wanted to talk about them because they're both really cool and I love them. So, let's get started. So, I'm going to tell you guys what's in common with them. They're both $10 a month and they come, like I said, once a month and they give you a questionnaire, like it's like a little quiz on how is your skin type, what is your hair like, like so they can kind of skim down what you want and how you want it. So it's a little personalized and also it gives you about five products each month. So that's great. So even if you don't like them, you can give them to friends or they can be party favors, anything. Like that. All right, so I'm first gonna talk about Birchbox. And they have these really cute boxes. Since it's called Birchbox, I'd hope it's boxes, but I just love the boxes. This one's like blue and yellow ombre. This one's more simple, but has like floral sides. And then this one's Rifle Paper Co. Love Rifle Paper Co. Talk about them all the time. And this one's a cute confetti one. And so yeah, the boxes are really cute with them. I've been subscribed for eight months. They're cute reusable boxes with themes each month, like I said. And they're more high-end products than Ipsy, but we're gonna talk about Ipsy later. Um, they may be geared for people like older than me, like 18 years and older, like my mom can use them. It's not like I can't use them. It's not like it's also inappropriate, but it's just, things for moisturizing and stuff that I may not need right now. So even though this is a great company, I'm not steering you away from it, but like I said, older perspective. But my biggest complaint I have to say is I've gotten the same item over um, a couple months. So I guess people are saying that you can tell them, hey, I got this thingamabob uh, twice in a row, and it's June 2015, so, um, apparently they'll send you a new thing, but that's my complaint. I do like this box a lot, and I'm going to keep subscribing to them. I like it. So, yeah, that's all I have to say. So, this is the June 2015 box, um, Birch box, and they just give you, like, how much each thing is, if you want to buy it in the future, and a little, little synopsis, and just like an intro card, and then you open it up. And the first thing is some Catherine Malgerano perfume. I like the smell of this one a lot. And then there's this really cool, like, knitted hair tie. <laughs> and uh, I just think it's cool. I mean, it's very heavy duty. And then this is Super Comb Prep and Protect Spray for your hair. And my mother says this is good. Um, I like the little crocodile there. Really cute. And then there's Super Goop Play Everyday Sunscreen. So this is a high protection sunscreen and I think it's good for your face because it is a makeup. So <laughs> that is just an inference, but I'll read the synopsis and clear it all out in the link of the description. And then in this cute little birch box thingy, magicy, magical thing, um, there's some Golden Glow Skin Enhancing BB Cream by Marcel, and also by Marcel, there is some Hypoallergenic Perfume Free Eyeliner. I'm not sure. All right, it is pencil eyeliner. I wasn't sure if it was gel, it looked kind of liquidy. But that was actually navy, so it goes really well with a lot of eye types. And I saw a video on that, I'll put that in the link. I'm putting a lot in the link in the description, make sure you check that out. But that was just a little unboxing. I didn't want to go too far into detail because um, I didn't want it to be a super long video for you guys. So that's just a quick little opening on what you might get when you subscribe to Birchbox. So, like
like I said, this is also $10. This is Ipsy, started by YouTuber Michelle Fawn. She's also a makeup person. You all probably know who she is. But this one comes in a reusable makeup bag, and this is this month. I think it's really cute. It's like neon, and it is stretchy in the back, and it has Ipsy embroidered all over the front. It's very soft black. And then this is last one's and it is a weave. I actually use it as a purse sometimes. It's really adorable. And then I'm not sure what the inside is, totally forgot. Um, it's just a see-through lining. But um, I like how colorful this one is. So those are those. I like about their little reusable makeup bags in case I am like ruined one because I'm a very destructible person. <laughs> but these have more products that you find in box stores, so they're also Roman, 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 what is that? Driven to teens, and so it's like lip glosses and nail varnishes and things like that along those lines. And one issue with Ipsy was the waiting list. I was almost on the waiting list for a half a year just to get my first subscription and my Aunt Christina, which I love her, shout out to her, um, told me about it last year's Thanksgiving and I recently got my Ipsy starting bags so it took a very long time, like extremely long and so that was a problem with that. But let's unbox this month's. Said I already described the bag. This one does not come with a card, but um, the first thing is leave-in conditioner, pure Brazilian micellaire, not micellaire, I've got micellaire water in my mind, miracle, duh. And so it's a spray, and it has very cute packaging, little paisleys and stuff, so definitely gonna use this in the future. And I actually have this nail polish on now. It stayed so long. I've had it for a week. And look at it. Look at that. That is like perfection. It usually lasts like half a day for me. But this is the Nail Lacquer with Hardener. It dried really fast. Absolute New York nail color. And the color turquoise. So not a special name. Just straight to the point. They don't want to mess around or anything. And then Dr. Brandt Pores No More Vacuum Cleaner. <laughs> A uh, blackhead extractor mask. So this is a mask. I have no idea it was a mask. But um, I like the color. This is a blue theme. Everything has been blue so far. Is that the theme this month? Oh, we're done with blue. But I love blue. Yes. Um, so now we have a pencil eyeliner. <laughs> it is the cab. Okay. I'm shadow. Um. So this is a mini shadow crayon, and so it's easy. I thought it was eyeliner. Honestly, I had no clue. I'm like clueless in life. And then lastly, the photo finish foundation primer by Smashbox. That is nice. And so yeah, that was definitely a little more fun and like teenager-ish. Not very good at describing things. <laughs> But, um, so that is Ipsy for you. Like I said, the long waiting list is a giant problem. But Michelle Vaughn, it was usually, um, it had a different name at first. But it's cool that it's done by a YouTuber, even though the waiting list is a pretty big problem. But, yeah, so that is Ipsy. $10 a month, you can't go wrong with either service, Ipsy or Birchbox. It's so worth it to have a package waiting for you in the mail every month. It's like Christmas all the time year round. So I say if you don't have anything you want, you can combine them with your unused toiletries from your hotel, you know, things you travel with. Since they're travel size, they're great. And you can donate them to a local shelter or give them to family and friends. Whatever you want to do. Tell me in the comments down below. Like this video if you think Birchbox wins and comment if you think Ipsy wins. So excited that this video is finally out. I will see you guys later. Bye!